Yo, what's up guys, Old School Dan here, and in this video, we're gonna talk about the Vince Gerana trick for insane gains. So, what is the Vince Gerana trick for insane gains? Well, Vince Gerana said that you shouldn't work out for more than 45 minutes. Larry Scott didn't work out for more than 45 minutes, and he used heavy weights. I'm talking about 90 pound dumbbells on the preacher curl, out in 45 minutes. There's a reason why. The reason being is because intensity builds muscle. Let me say that again. Intensity builds muscle. And the main concept behind that, well, if you've ever read Steve Reeves' book, Classic Physique or Dynamic Muscle Building, there's a part where he says that, oh, people think that more is better. Like, oh, if I spend three, four hours in the gym, oh, I'll get so much more results compared to someone who spends like 45 minutes or about an hour in the gym. Steve Reeves says no, and this is true. And just think about if you've ever seen Steve Reeves' routine. It's about nine sets of body part, and he just got like, I don't know how many, we got like tons of body parts. Anyways, it's like over 50 sets a workout, right? And he wouldn't spend more than two and a half hours. You're probably thinking, wow, he must be working pretty hard. Yeah, he moves pretty quick. Same thing with Larry Scott. He would move insanely fast. And the main reason they move so fast is because, well, other than, um, you know, intensity builds muscle, but the other reason is because they want to accomplish a lot in a short amount of time. Um, Larry Scott, if you've ever seen his workout, it's it's pretty long. His arm workout's pretty long, right? And if he could accomplish that in 45 minutes, that's insane. That's, you, you could imagine, it's, it's very fast, right? Same thing with um, Steve Reeves' workout. It's a, over 50 sets. It's a full body workout, you know what I mean? And for him to finish that in two and a half hours, maybe, I don't know, maybe less or a little bit more, that's insane. But you really have to adopt this principle or you know idea into your workouts. And you know what? Just think about every champion bodybuilder who's ever lived that you know. You know, Steve Reeves, Larry Scott, Arn Schwarzenegger. Arn Schwarzenegger. Let's take him for example. One time, I heard a story about Ed Corny and Arn Schwarzenegger. Arn was training, and they and you know they were training together. And you know you could just imagine how Arn works out. Probably pretty fast. He's probably you, you've you've heard about Arnold's training. You know, it's really intense. So they were training and then you know Arnold was you know finished his set and then Ed Corny went and as he finished Arnold was like you know let's go come on you know let's keep going and he was like oh, dude like hold on let me cast my breath damn man and he was like come on dude you rest too long so right now you're probably thinking well what's the Vince Gerana trick well I kind of just gave it away right now the trick is shorter rest time Steve Reeves recommends 45 seconds of rest if not whenever your training partner is done with his set you go that's how I like to do I really like it like that Vince Gerana on the 8x8 routine requires a minimum of like 15 seconds of rest time in between sets. So it's like you do eight reps and then you wait 15 seconds, boom, boom, boom for the whole entire eight sets. You only get 15 seconds of rest. That sounds insane, right? Look, I know it sounds really intense, but trust me, this type of training with like, I'm talking about less rest time gets you so ripped and so muscular so fast, it's crazy. This is something I've been doing lately and it's the same thing with that other thing I was talking about in the last video I just posted. It was about um, going reps to failure and you know, doing this like less rest time, dude, makes such a big difference. Everybody I've trained with, like I have a friend named Danny who I've been recently training, like he's been getting more results lately. He's like, damn dude, like before I was training like a bitch, you know, and I was like taking my sweet ass time with my sets. But like every time I work out with you, like it just, it's, it's very intense. It's tough. And you know what? A lot of us are guilty of this, you know, like we're taking our time in between our sets. We're talking to someone, we're on our phone, we're changing the song, we're trying to catch our breath but in reality we should be pushing ourselves harder because we can't just think about it could you be pushing yourself harder could you just not bring music to the gym or that's that sounds crazy but no i don't bring music to the gym anyways but could you you know just have like a playlist that you set and just not touch your phone for the whole entire gym that way you can have a more intense workout or could you just like not talk to anybody at the gym or could you just like take less rest time because you know the body is an amazing machine like we're the most complex machine on in the planet right we are very unique you know interesting we can recover very fast you know we we adapt to things very quickly as well so i mean it won't be long before you get used used to this type of training you know with like less rest time yes um it may be difficult at first yes everything you do that you're not used to is difficult at first but once you get used to it, you start to, you know, reap the actual results. What's the overall lesson here? All right. Well, the overall lesson is like stop BSing it in the gym. You know, get in there and get out. Like stop taking your time, you know, stop taking so much damn rest time. You know, try to get out of the gym as fast as possible with but with the most quality reps and sets. Um, and then also take less rest time, maybe 45 seconds, maybe even less, or you can try the um 
one training partner after the other and then once you're done when he's done you go or something like that but that is a big lesson that is the Vince Gerana trick so yeah that is the Vince Gerana trick less rest time and get out of the gym as fast as possible so I hope you enjoyed this video with that being said subscribe for more videos like this give this video a thumbs up thanks for watching this is old school Dan checking out peace